Are you stuck indoors like the rest of us, wondering how you can help? Click the link below to support Direct Relief. They provide personal protective equipment and essential medical items to health workers responding to coronavirus. Please do your part and give what you can. In a world where Warner Brothers wishes Jared Leto never existed. In fact, where all of Suicide Squad was a lie. Forget it ever happened. The one part you liked about the film has been plucked from an early grave and given her own squad. Just don't let her do the tattoos this time. You spelled a tattoo wrong? I, spe I was writing a word and I spelled it wrong. <laughs> a good time to be pretty. <laughs> birds of Prey and the... Uh, I'm not reading that part out loud. Meet the Birds of Prey. Meet the new Harley Quinn. Eventually. A lot of people in this city want me dead. Any minute now. The perfect egg sandwich. No? Okay, fine. Meet Harley Quinn. After a breakup with Jared Leto's body double, she's out to prove she's more than just a lady joker. So she's forming her own criminal gang, but not taking it seriously, while cracking jokes in clown makeup and using goofy weapons to fight a rich guy dressed in black. Huh, this doesn't really seem like much of an emancipation to me. More of a sparkly do-over? That's not very scrumptulescent. Not even wubtubulous if you ask me. Explore Gotham City like you've never seen it before. In the daylight. Ew, weird. But threatening to conquer it all is a homicidal trust fund kid in blackface. I mean black mask, but also blackface. I got it when I was embedded with the Ngami tribe in Congo, Kinshasa. Ewan McGregor shines as the owner of the world's worst club to hang out at. Get on the <laughs> game. Now dance. Woohoo! Who blends the lines between sadistic mob boss, bro culture avatar, and just gay enough to hope it slides past the censors in China? So, are you guys gay in the movie? It's very complicated. Their relationships is, is very much yeah. uh, based in there's a want and a need in there for yeah. sure. As he hams his way into another great villain performance that'll get ripped on for decades because he's different than the guy in the comics. <sighs> really looking forward to hearing about this and the Mandarin until the sun explodes. Gathered to stop him are the titular birds of prey. This is our story. Uh, almost. Can we just fast forward to them teaming up? We're gonna have to work together. There we go. There's Huntress, a realistic portrayal of how awkward an orphan who trained to become a murder hobo would actually be. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Cassandra Cain, a kid. Sorry, kid. Hey, kid! Keep the kid alive! Price on the kid's head. You've got the wrong kid. Come on, kid. Kid, 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 kid. Shoot them, kid. Renee Montoya, a cop with a special power to. Okay, she's just a cop. And Black Canary, she sings really loud and, uh, kicks good and stuff. I'm just saying, I know more about Katana than these ladies, and I only know four things about Katana. One. This is Katana. Two. She's got my back. Three. I would advise not getting killed by her. And four. Her sword traps the souls of its victims. DC does not stand for develop characters. So suit up for an R-rated ride that's more Bugs Bunny than Batman. Do us that for me, will you? <gasps> but combines a great cast with awesome fight sequences to make this Hot Topic version of Beyonce's Lemonade that will thrill and delight your inner teenager, but since it's rated R for no good reason, went unseen by actual teenagers. Guess you couldn't tell the story right without turning that guy's leg into spaghetti. <laughs> Starring Dr. Quinn, Offer Medicine Woman. Hello, my name is Renee Montoya. You stole my promotion. Prepare to die. Obi-Wan Jabroni. Sonic Boom! Ramona Glowers. Diamond Digest Forever! Scar Tissue That I'll Make You Saw. The hottest nightclub in Gotham is the Black Mask Club. This place has everything. Broken legs, sad lounge singers, a single narrow room with no dance floor, and a scared Erica. It's the thing where your name is Erica, and the creepy owner of the club makes you get on a table and dance to no music. Always DA Maybe. Dr. Marvin Candle. Joe Exotic 2020. And Jared Leto. You all know who that is? Sounds like a dick. Insane Clown's Posse. And that is why you should never partake in paying federal income taxes. Whoa, Harley doesn't pay taxes and voted for Bernie? Now that's some Joker stuff. Thanks for watching, and once again, please click the link below to support Direct Relief. Anything helps. And remember, wash your hands.
With great mustache comes bad CGI. I saw a tiger, and the tiger saw a man.